I'm super excited right now. I just harvested my first ever cucumbers. Woo! Uh, they came off of these vines right here. There was only one cucumber on each vine. Um, all the other little cucumbers that were popping up, they just kind of withered and died. And, you know, they're still flowering and stuff, but it seems like they could only support one of these massive cucumbers at a time. Um, especially with the amount of water that they're getting because we're just past spring. So I'm sure that uh, they were just using all of um, the water to fill up these big old mammoths. I'm really excited to pickle these. Uh, when I was a kid, we used to go to, I remember going to the football games and getting like giant cucumbers or giant pickles that were this size. And I'd sit and I'd eat on these things all day until my lips were white. <laughs> I love myself a pickle but um yeah I'm just really excited to pickle these and you know maybe experience some of that nostalgia and you know also eat a bomb ass pickle while I'm at it take two <laughs> I'm suspicious. Oh, looky there. Oh my God. How soon can we pickle them? I know. <laughs> we can pickle them right now. Which yeah, I think we little, should. All the little pricklies fell off. Well, I rubbed them off. Oh. Yeah, that's all it takes. You just do this and they just come off. Wow. Yeah. Look at the size of those honkers. <laughs> you want to try one? Yeah, I want to try one. Mm. Let's rehydrate with a fresh cucumber. Cheers. Hi. Well. Oh. Uh, That's terrible. Oh my god. Did you get that on video? The skin tastes like regret. regret. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the skin is so bad. <laughs> It's like licking the inside of someone's ear. <laughs> oh, the inside's not much better. I don't know what happened. Oh, it made my mouth feel funny. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> it feels like you just took a bite out of an unripe persimmon. God, that was a waste. We can cut, we can cut the ends off and pickle them anyway. Oh, well, still, I had Lord. to know. Bro, well, I don't know, man. Do, like, Do we pick them too late? Or too early? Well, this doesn't look too early. I, with This is a mystery that only Google can solve. Or someone who's grown pickling cucumbers. If you know why our cucumbers taste like unripe persimmon earwax, please let us know because... This is a disaster. So, why exactly were our cucumbers bitter? Well, I asked the Google that exact question. And the Google informed me that it is indeed a chemical called cucurbitacin that is the culprit. So cucurbitacin, um, or cucurbitacin, however you want to say it, comes from the cucurbitaceae family. And the cucurbitaceae is talking about gourds and melons, you know, stuff like that. Now, cucurbitacin lives inside of the leaves and stems of all of the plants from the cucurbitaceae family. How does the cucurbitacin itself find its way into the plant, into the fruit of the plant? Well, it could be, you know, one of many different things. But here are a few of the reasons why it could have happened. Lack of water. That is a very real possibility. It was at the end of spring and so our plants weren't getting as much water as they once were when it was time for, you know, the fruit to start to mature. It could also be 
too hot. Now, since it was the end of spring and coming into the beginning of summer, we very often uh, get into triple digits here in Central Texas. So it could have been 98, 99 oh. degrees, almost busting 100 degrees here at the time when the cucumbers were starting to ripen. And so that could have also affected it. It could have also been hereditary. And hereditary just means that it's it's um, that way from the seed. So um, if it's in the seed, it could grow into a bitter plant. No matter what you do, the fruit are going to be bitter. But I'm thinking that it was not hereditary. I have a feeling that it was lack of a combination of lack of water and too hot. So how do we make sure that this doesn't happen again? Um, so the next time, we will just plant in the spring. If you plant cucumbers at the beginning of spring, that is prime time for a good cucumber harvest. Because it's the, the weather is nice and mellow, it also gets lots of rain, and so if you neglect the plant a little bit, it won't matter. Uh, so if you say don't water it for a while, this, the uh, spring rains will kind of help you out with that. And it also needs full sun. Now in the spring, the sun is out and it's beautiful, but it's not too hot. It is just perfect time for cucumbers. So we will try again next, next time, except for, you know, at the right time. Uh, so back to the video. Lesson learned, <laughs> education. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> If you nourish it, it will grow. Peace.